good, pretty good. shoulder and we kept asking you when you take these more these maintenance days off and you kept telling us that's nothing I'm just uh, it's been a while but obviously it's been uh, good enough to play and and uh, it feels better today um, it was good to be on the trip with the boys he has to be around the team and um, gives a lot of energy it's a lot of fun um, you just got to take it day by day here um, but I'm happy how it feels uh, feels right now so when you were playing it wasn't like you're injured and you had to be out for weeks, but you still probably couldn't do things. It probably was in your head all the time when you were playing. Yeah, uh, it's it's something you learn when you when you're in this league. Um, you play a lot. You play through a lot of stuff, and and sometimes it comes to a point when you have to be smart. Um, it's tough for a player to say uh, uh, it's not good enough, and and I cannot really do my job out there, but uh, we have a great medical staff, and, and like I said, uh, I'm just looking forward to, uh, to the future, and it feels pretty good today. You could have gutted it out probably till the end of the season, but you figured, okay, okay, just get this done for a couple of weeks now, rather than it getting even worse. As the yeah, yeah, hopefully uh, uh, hopefully we'll make it to the playoffs, and I'm, I'm going to have a, a good uh, good rod, good push here in the end, and uh, hopefully a good playoff, so... Uh, like I said, we're just going to take this day by day, but it feels uh, feels good today. This is the same thing as you had back in, in Sweden? Uh, no, it's a little bit different. Uh, I don't know all the medical terms for it, but uh, like I said, we have a, a good group of guys that's working on it, and, and the progress has been really good lately. So uh, I'm happy where it's at right now, and uh, we'll see how it is tomorrow. A couple of guys that are uh, coming back from injuries have been struggling a bit with their re-entry. How long do you think it'll take you to get up to speed? Uh, hopefully I'll be ready to go right away. Uh, it's obviously a little bit different when you when you haven't played for a while with, with timing and all that, but I think that's uh, that's very individual and, and the body feels pretty good. And, and uh, I've, been, I've been skating, been on the ice a lot just to keep the, the feel for, for the ice to be out there and, and skating-wise. Um, like I said, it feels pretty good on the ice uh, today, so... Uh, but once again, uh, we're just going to see how it is tomorrow, and, and we're going to reevaluate tomorrow morning and see how where's that. You were at 25 minutes plus a game. Uh, you walk in and do that. Today. Yeah, hopefully that's that's what I'm aiming for. Um, I think the guys has been uh, doing a good job without me. Uh, put ourselves in a really good spot here for for the last couple of games. So um, coming back is going to be obviously a lot of fun, and and hopefully I can bring some some good energy and and obviously bring some hockey good or some good hockey. So some of these you could play tomorrow. You're not totally ruling it out. No, um, I want to get back. I, if you ask me, I, I want to play on the trip. Uh, but you got to be smart. Obviously, uh, uh, we still have some some important games, and I want to be 100 percent to go. So, uh, um, but once again, we're going to see how it is tomorrow, and, and maybe I play, maybe maybe not. We're just going to take this day by day. So how could you play 25 minutes if you had a bad shot? <laughs> uh, I guess you got to. Adapt your game a little bit, be, uh, be a little bit smart. Um, obviously, it's when you're out there, you don't really think about the shoulder, and that's if you start thinking about your shoulder and, and try to position yourself not to get hit, and vice versa, it's, it's going to be tough to be out there. Um, but once again, it feel, feels pretty good right now, and, and hopefully, it feels even better tomorrow. And as soon as I'm I'm good to go, I, I'm going to be out there and so help the, the guys. Yeah, uh, yeah, basically. Um, yeah, exactly, and that's where you learn uh, when you're in this league for for a long time uh, to play through bumps and bruises. And it's that time of year. A lot of uh, a lot of teams have guys that are uh, they're a little banged up, uh, but once again, uh, the body feels pretty good, and just being out there and skate and, and stick handle feels good. You look at the schedule and say, what's the NHL doing when you got to play every second day for two months, and every team seems like that. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 a tough stretch. Um, I don't know. We had like 15, yeah. 15 games in twenty eight days or something, and that's that's something you learn to to be a pro. Uh, and, and it's it's tough. And especially I remember coming over from Europe. It's a, it's a different it's a different game, especially mentally to to just play night after night and 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 hopefully play a good solid game for for sixty minutes and. Uh, Obviously, like I said, the boys has been playing pretty good without me, so we we're in a really good situation here, and um, hopefully we can continue uh, have a good playoff push and get some some important points here um, the next coming days.